Now, the Indian Space Agency ISRO has begun the countdown for the INSAT 3DS, its second launch mission of 2024. The weather monitoring spacecraft is built entirely by ISRO, and amongst other things, the satellite is also expected to serve the needs of government agencies that are involved in providing advance warnings on weather related phenomena. And our correspondent Siddharth MP gets you all the details. The 52-meter-tall, 420-ton rocket known as GSLV Mark II or GSLV will be used to loft the 2.27-ton satellite into its designated orbit. The INSAT-3DS will augment the services of India's existing weather monitoring satellites INSAT-3D and INSAT-3DR. Weather monitoring satellites are placed almost 36,000 kilometers above the Earth's equator from where they get a wide view of an entire region of interest. However, in this case, the satellite would be monitoring the entire Indian subcontinent and adjoining regions for collecting weather-related data which will help the government agencies in monitoring a wide area to assess the weather events that are emerging, particularly in the oceans. Earlier this week, India's Minister of Earth Sciences visited the Indian spaceport and witnessed the launch preparations. The weather data generated from the INSAT-3D-S satellite would be used by the agencies and institutions that fall under the Indian Ministry of Earth Sciences. Designated as GSLV F-14, this will be the 16th flight of India's GSLV rocket. The launch mission is expected to take under 19 minutes. The primary objectives of the INSAT-3DS satellite are to monitor the Earth's surface, to carry out oceanic observations, to carry out data on various meteorological parameters, among others. The Indian Space Agency ISRO has commenced a 27 and a half hour long countdown for its second launch mission of this year. This mission is being called GSLV F-14 INSAT 3DS. The launch vehicle or the rocket is known as GSLV F-14 and this satellite has been designated as INSAT 3DS which is a weather monitoring satellite. The countdown began this afternoon Indian time at 2.05 pm and this countdown is underway at the Satish Dhawan Space Center in Srihari Kota. This is a 27 and a half hour long countdown which will come to an end at 5.35 p.m. on Saturday evening Indian time. So at that time exactly the launch vehicle GSLV will blast off from the second launch pad of the spaceport. This is a mission that will take 19 minutes from end to end which is from liftoff until the satellite is deployed into its destination orbit. This countdown itself is a technical process during which various health checks of the different systems and subsystems of the rocket will be carried out and the final few hours of the countdown the liquid fuels and the supercooled cryogenic fuels of the rocket will be filled and once all is go and all systems are normal the launch is authorized from chennai siddharth mp we on world is one we on is now available in your country download the app now and get all the news on the move